I thought I had a flu. Um, and then the flu never went away. When I'm in a crash, it feels like I have the flu and someone put a 10,000 pound lead suit on me. And so even if I would try with all my might to get up, I can't. In fact, it takes a lot of energy for me to just breathe. It, is, it affects the body and it slows you down. You have no energy. You have all these uh, uh, sudden allergies that you have to contend with. Many of us can't get out of the bed. Many of us can't speak or handle any kind of stimulation. So it was very much wheelchair bound, having a lot of IBD type symptoms. The autoimmune cascade started. It's just an awful, it's an awful feeling to not be able to do anything. You just sort of feel like you're in a living death. My father was so ill for so long, um, and he was very severe. In his last year of life, it would take him a half an hour to crawl from his bed to the bathroom and a half an hour to crawl back to the bed. And he was in tremendous pain. He was so weak. It shuts you down in ways that you can't even imagine on so many levels. and. Um, and just makes it so that you're unable to do much of anything um, due to uh, fatigue and pain and something we refer to as orthostatic intolerance, which I'm sure every, you know, people in the community know about, but an inability to be upright for long periods of time. Um, so I think that's the really difficult part of it is just that I feel like I'm constantly having the rug pulled out from underneath me.